So you want to customize the startup of your blender to look like mine. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this video is for you. Hey guys, welcome back to Kai. I'm Kai and today we are back once again in uh, Blender. And as you can see, this is how my Blender starts up. I have not done anything. If I go to File, New, and then just hit General, you can see it will just load this up. This is, this is it. I, this is my default Blender. Um, so I got everything turned off. The grid isn't on. This isn't on. I don't have the outliner up here. This isn't, this isn't on. I, I, it's completely customized. And all of my other scenes up here are also gone. Um, it just, they're just gone. The, the way that I did this is super simple. So, um, let's say that I wanted this to be bigger. I wanted this to be like half a screen. And I also wanted this to be split in two. And I wanted this bottom one to be the shader editor, right? Let's say I wanted like, oh, I want to close that as well. And also let's, let's open up the, the, let's make a new material. And then we'll just have that right there center like that. Let's say I want my blender to look exactly like this every single time I open a new project. And actually I want on the, the, the material tab as well. I, I want to look exactly like this every single time I open my Blender. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to File, and we're going to go all the way down to Defaults, and hit Save a Startup File, and then hit Save. So now, I can go ahead and I can change this around. I can close all this. I can close that. I can turn this to wireframe mode. I can turn my overlays back on. I can zoom out like this. Um, I can open a tab here on the left-hand side, and you can see if we go to File, New, General, Don't Save, my Blender will open exactly the way that we had it before. By default, I can close Blender and open it, and it will look like this every single time. Now, if you want to go back to the default loadout, we'll go to File, Defaults, Load Factory Settings, Load Factory Settings, and then we have Default Blender. And now, if you want it to stay like this, instead of when you open it again, then you just go to Default, Save Startup File like this, and now I can move this around, I can open this up, I can close this, and when we go to New, General, it will open Blender the way Blender was supposed to be opened the first time before you started messing around with it. You customization, you customization god. Yes. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for two days. Changing your startup file and saving it as like a template kind of preset. I will see you, ladies and gentlemen, in the next one, but until then. Bye-bye.